Alright, so hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to make a ton of money off of Roblox, uh, retail tycoon 2. So I'm going to be starting this from the very beginning. I already have made, like, other, um, saved files, unlocked land, and all the upgrades, like the massive parking lots and everything. So I'm just going to be showing you how to make it off from the start. So the first thing you want to do is, say you have $5,000, right? What you want to do is go to your build, you want to bulldoze all of this because once you start expanding your plot you're gonna have to rebuild and rebuild and rebuild and it is just not worth it plus you get a little extra cash from this and your ratings don't matter oops do not break the concrete though leave the concrete so I accidentally messed up now I'm gonna have to buy some more okay so the first thing you want to do is go to your furnish mode the self checkout is a very good investment because the registered you have to pay a cashier. Uh, it's pretty small right now, so not many people are going to buy stuff. So honestly, just buy the self checkout, right? So one of the things you want to start out is with is the display table because you can sell tablets that way and they make a lot of money. Also, a really good one is the freezer and the shelves for candy. So you want to stock these things up. So I like to stock it up. I feel like it might be better to stock it up this way. So it's 80, so it is good. 30 candy. Well, I can't yet because the storage unit. So then go to manage and then oops, wrong one. So restock container. And now let's buy the other stuff. So that would be the candy. And also on the tablets, I think you get six of these. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, you get six of these, and you get the candy. Restock that. We have about a mm, thousand three hundred dollars left, so we can maybe get one more thing. Hats. Hats sell a lot. Remember that. Hats. Oh, they are a very good seller. They, they sell very quickly, and you make a lot of profit from them. I 12 of these real quick and there we go we spent all our money but it's all in stock so once they buy it once everything has been bought I'm gonna um, speed this up for now and when everything's gone I'll show you how much money I make all right guys so once you have about like two thousand five hundred dollars Go to your upgrades and get the upgraded parking lot, uh, get the gravel lot for 2500 This will allow you to have more cars, which equals more customers, so your stuff gets bought quicker. And after that, you want to probably buy uh, an upgraded sign. So once we get, let's say, $1,000, we'll upgrade the sign. So that should be in a little bit. But I've already restocked it a little bit because some of the stuff is sold out. Um... So, yeah, so, um, once I get $1,000, I'll upgrade the sign. Let me just fast forward to then. But these guys take a long time to choose what they want. All they do is spin around. Also, uh, if you get spills, just clean them up and help your ratings. Nothing really else, but then eventually you want to get, like, a five-star rating, which is awesome. All right, guys, I think I need to join another server because usually they do not spin like this, and it makes them very slow. So if they're spinning like this in your server, just join a different one because it's really weird. Nope, I guess they're still spinning. A little. It's not as bad. I don't think it is. Yeah, it is much better. See, in the... Well, actually, I don't know. <laughs> it's kind of weird. I guess it's just like that, but... That's weird. In this server, it's better. They spun for like five minutes last time. Ooh, yeah. So, if you see these dudes with the white hats, they buy a ton of stuff. The, I call them the rich dudes. They always buy your stuff. No, they buy a ton. Usually, they get, like, a tablet or two. See, look. All these tablets, there were just five of them. Now, there's only one. So, I'm going to make a ton of money off of those. Yeah, this server is much better. They're not spinning around a ton. They still are. But they don't spin around it for no reason for, like, a couple, like five minutes. That was just ridiculous. Oh, this dude's about to check out. He's going to give me so much money. Let's see. Come on, buddy. Come on. Yep. Come 
home, buddy. Give me all your money. I'm waiting on you. Oh my gosh, they're complaining about the lines. Well, instead of getting the sign, I'm going to save up for another self-checkout because these people cannot handle themselves when the line has three people. Okay, I will fix that soon. But I have to make enough money first. If you, uh, so, here's the choice. In if you, instead of getting in the parking lot, you can get another self-checkout. It's up to you. You can do either way, it's fine, but I think the parking lot was worth it for me. And I'm all out of tablets, wow. Let's see, do I have it to restock? Leftover. That, I need to get some tablets, dang it. I gotta spend my money first to get some money. Restock. Why do I, I swear, I bought six, not seven. Uh, oh well. Ooh, let's do checking out, I wanna see what it got. Tablet. Hey, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, that's all, that's all. Dang it. it okay, yeah, I'm gonna need, I'm gonna definitely need another self-checkout because this is very slow. These people keep complaining. Oh, I'm fed up with the waiting. They're putting their stuff back. No! They're putting all their items back because they, they don't. There was, somebody had a towel that they were gonna buy, but then they didn't have the, the lines made them mad, so it costs, it, yeah, it costs you business, so you really need to get another self-checkout as soon as you can. Or a cashier, it depends. I personally like the self-checkouts, because eventually you'll need to upgrade to them. But eh, for now, I'm just going to get a cashier, because it's, it's ruining my business, and I really need to make money fast. So I'll just be the cashier for the beginning, until... I delete it and get a uh, self-checkout. Alright, so, once you guys get the $2,500 parking lot and the $1,000 sign, you want to start uh, buying more land. Uh, how you do that is you go upgrades and buy more land. You want to buy this, 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 and maybe, yeah, you want to buy them in that order. These thousands, and then you want to get the three two thousands right here, and build it with concrete because it's cheap. Once you get more money, you can upgrade it and make it look nicer. But that's all you're gonna want. After you get the thousand sign, which I don't have right now because um, I'm about to get it in the two thousand five hundred parking lot. All you really need is to upgrade the parking lot. Okay, so after this, you you don't want to buy that, and you don't want to buy that. You want to go straight to this. It might seem crazy, but honestly, it's worth it because you don't have to spend ten, five thousand. You don't have to spend fifteen thousand dollars in between getting that, and that's a giant parking lot. And then once you get it, it'll increase your business by a ton. See, I'm making enough money right now, so it's not really a problem. So eventually, you'll get it. it might take a while, but it's better than buying all the things in between. You would just want to go straight to the most expensive after you get this. After you get this sign in the gravel parking lot, only get the most expensive sign in parking lot after that. Because that's the only thing that's worth it. Just upgrade your land first, get more types of um you want to eventually get every single display item because uh that's how you unlock money trees because you have to sell like 10 of everything so some of these shelves of you're gonna have to buy multiple multiple of them this one you're gonna have to have five normal shelves you're gonna have to have three display shelves two fridges and like three display tables and like a hat rack you only need one hat rack and only one clothing rack but you're gonna need two racks and um after that you just want to get restockers here I'll, I'll show you um let me go to my other save file. Let me just save this. And load this. See, um, I already have the big sign, the big parking lot. And here's the room for all the self-checkouts. You're going to need, eventually, six. Eventually. Literally, that's silly. Uh, then you're, 
Hats sell a lot, so I bought a lot of them. Same with goes for clothes. But these stuffs, I just bought one of everything because I want to get the badge to get more money trees. So try to sell one of everything. For example, all this stuff over here. That's like one of everything. Uh, and then all this for restocking stuff because... You, once your store is big enough, I suggest you get a manager, and then you go into your settings, and you say this, you want to get two pets per minute. You have to check mark this, and then your manager will buy you two pets every minute. These restockers will go to the crates, find the um, pets, I think they're over here, yeah, they'll find the pets and add two into the supply. So, you never really have to do anything. It's just your manager. So, if you get, like, janitors, they'll clean up the spills for you. Same with the guards, they'll uh, arrest the criminals. And then you don't have to do anything. Your your store just operates on, it own, on its own, and you make a ton of money. See, right now I'm in negatives because nobody's buying stuff, and I have to pay all my staff. But once people will start buying stuff, I'll make a lot more money. Also, I forgot to add my other money tree. There we go. I, oh, since I was a negative, I couldn't place it. There we go. Yes, yeah, so that's pretty much the tutorial for uh, Retail Tycoon. Hope you guys enjoyed. I uh, hope it helps you. And, yeah, see you guys in the next video. Bye.